Hello everybody. If you want to read all the stories in full, please go to www.steveuk.blog. Thank you. Short Story 263, A Day in the Park It was a beautiful spring day and Emma decided to spend her afternoon in the park. She packed a small picnic basket with some sandwiches, fruit and a bottle of water, then headed out the door. When Emma arrived at the park, she found a nice spot under a large oak tree and laid out her picnic blanket. The park was quite crowded with families, joggers and groups of friends all enjoying the sunny weather. Children were running and playing, their laughter filling the air. Emma sat down on her blanket and took a deep breath, soaking in the peaceful atmosphere. She opened her picnic basket and took out her sandwich. As she began to eat, she noticed a small puppy running towards her, chasing a bright red ball. The puppy ran right up to Emma, wagging its tail and looking up at her with big, friendly eyes. Hello there, Emma said, smiling and reaching down to the pet the puppy. Just then a young man came running over to collect the puppy. I'm so sorry, he said, slightly out of breath. This little guy got away from me. I hope he didn't bother you. Not at all, Emma replied. He's adorable. Is he your dog? Yes, his name is Buddy. The man said, I'm just taking him for a walk in the park. I'm sorry again for the disturbance. Don't worry about it, Emma assured him. I'm enjoying the company. The man smiled and called Buddy, who reluctantly left Emma's side to follow his owner. Emma watched as they continued on their way, the puppy happily trotting beside the man. Emma finished her sandwich and decided to take a short walk around the park. As she wandered along the winding paths, she admired the budding flowers and the fresh green grass. She came across a group of children playing on the swings and slides, their laughter and shrieks of delight echoing through the park. Further down the path, Emma noticed an older couple sitting on a bench, holding hands and watching the world go by. She couldn't help but smile at the simple, peaceful scene. After her walk, Emma returned to her picnic spot and lay down on the blanket, gazing up at the fluffy white clouds drifting across the bright blue sky. She felt herself begin to relax, the stresses of the week melting away. Suddenly, Emma heard the sound of music nearby. She sat up and looked around, eventually spotting a small group of musicians playing guitars and singing under a large tree. She listened for a while, tapping her foot to the rhythm of the music. As the sun began to set, casting a warm glow over the park, Emma decided it was time to head home. She packed up her picnic things and took one last look around, taking in the beauty of the park on this lovely spring day. What a wonderful way to spend an afternoon, she thought to herself as she made her way back home, feeling refreshed and rejuvenated. Vocabulary Notes Picnic Basket A small portable container used to carry food and supplies for a picnic. Example Emma packed a small picnic basket with some sandwiches, fruit and a bottle of water. Blanket A large piece of cloth used for sitting or lying on, especially outdoors. Example Emma laid out her picnic blanket under a large oak tree. Laughter, the sound made when someone laughs, expressing amusement or joy. Example, the children's laughter filled the air as they ran and played in the park. Wagging, to move a part of the body, especially the tail, to and fro in a quick, lively way. Example, the puppy ran up to Emma, wagging its tail and looking at her with big, friendly eyes. Reluctantly, unwillingly, or with hesitation. Example, Buddy reluctantly left Emma's side to follow his owner. Budding, of a plant, developing new growth, especially leaves or flowers. Example, Emma admired the budding flowers and fresh green grass as she wandered along the winding paths. Echoing, of a sound repeating or reverberating. 
Example, the children's shrieks of delight echoed through the park. Melting away, to disappear or fade gradually. Example, the stresses of the week melted away as Emma lay on the blanket, glazing up at the clouds. Glow, a soft, warm light. Example, the sun began to set, casting a warm glow over the park. Refreshed and rejuvenated. Feeling renewed, revived or re-energized. Example, Emma felt refreshed and rejuvenated after spending the afternoon in the park. Story written by OneMin.ai Image created by OneMin.ai to read all the stories in full, please go to www.steveuk.blog. Thank you. Hello, this is Steve. If you enjoyed the story, please would you take the time to leave a meaningful comment and click on the like icon. If you want to know when the next story has been uploaded, please click on the notify bell icon to be notified. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and tell your English learning friends so they can benefit too. Thank you.